Living here in El Rosario is living in a healthy environment. We get up at daybreak and everyone takes their tool, shovel, pick and hoe to go to the field and work with the sole purpose of building a more prosperous community. This is El Rosario, a small community located two hours from Guatemala City, whose story of transformation has inspired the whole nation. This community has witnessed great changes which have contributed to its development and growth. But we wonder, how have these changes been possible? Today is Thursday, and Yomila is with her roundtable members, a group of people who learn and share principles and values once a week as part of the Transformation is in Me program. The Transformation is in Me program has helped me tremendously because I used to be very negative, very shy, but now it has helped me grow. I've done things that I never imagined I would do, and I feel like I can help others move forward. Eduardo Magermans, Executive Director of Guatemala Prospera, a non for profit, non partisan, and non religious association which seeks to transform the nation through programs with values, particularly the Transformation is in Me program. Bueno, realmente las mesas redondas aportaron ese fuego de transformación. The round tables really kindled the fire of transformation, not only from the inside out, but to really try and find a way to influence their surroundings directly. And that's what the round tables have done with each person, men and women from El Rosario, creating an identity, generating teamwork, and above all, adding value to each person so that they can contribute to transformation. Para poder aportar en esa transformación. At the beginning of a Transformation is in Me roundtable, I could see that women were very shy, fearful, and insecure. But as the weeks go by, I realized they've changed. They're not fearful anymore. They're more positive and function better. Roundtables kindled a fire in El Rosario. A fire that leads them to look for ways to stand out and reach sustainable development of the community. And what Guatemala Prospera has done is simply provide sustainable development tools so that this community can progress without receiving handouts, but rather by generating change internally by each community member. Generado internamente por cada uno de los comunitarios. El Rosario, with the support of Guatemala Prospera, started to implement social development programs in education, health, and economy. The idea of improving the school's conditions in order to promote education in El Rosario came from Transformation is in Me roundtables. It is thanks to the Transformation is in Me program that we could see three very important aspects of the school staff, responsibility, honesty, and fellowship. The colleagues were more punctual, they complied with their evaluations, and above all, improved their teaching activity. The fact that our school has been a model for the rest of the schools in Chimaltenango is proof of the honesty demonstrated by the teachers. Roundtables awakened an interest in the wellness and health of the community. Therefore, a medical clinic, which now takes care of more than 25 people daily, was installed and equipped. I've seen the results of Transformation is in Me reflected in the goals we have set each year because we have reached them and people have become more responsible and aware of taking care of their health. The Gardens Project has been one more response to the change that roundtables have motivated in El Rosario. Now. They produce high-quality food with the resources they already have at hand. Ever since I've been a part of a round table, I've been more aware of my health. I used to eat a bag of chips and drink a soda. Now I realize that it wasn't healthy. 
That is how we began with the family gardens, where each family grows different kinds of vegetables and legumes for their own consumption or to sell to their neighbors, the causing better nutrition and an additional income. The Transformation is in Me program has awakened an attitude of productivity in El Rosario, which is why different entrepreneurship courses were imparted and the Savings Boxes project motivates investments for home improvement. Ever since I participated in the Transformation is in Me roundtables, I felt more motivated and confident to start up a new business. The saving boxes worked really well for me. I could develop the discipline to save each week, and thanks to that, I started my own small business. El Rosario is, without a doubt, a community which leaves values in its daily life, and which has proven to our country that transformation is possible when it begins in ourselves. Nos sentimos muy afortunados. We feel very fortunate that the Transformation is in Me program came to El Rosario because we saw the change in our people, in our community. And this can be a tool for any other community. We are deeply thankful. Muy agradecidos. Primero que nada, quiero agradecer. First of all, I would like to thank the people of El Rosario and other communities which have opened their doors for Transformation is in Me to come in. Also, the Board of Directors and members of Guatemala Prospera are really thankful for the John C. Maxwell Foundation and all the support they have provided us during all these years. And today, I want to invite you, if you want to participate with us, whether you are in Guatemala or in another country, remember that Guatemala Prospera and the John C. Maxwell Foundation can open doors for you to be an agent of change and witness a nation transformed.